In this video, we will introduce the scales in engineering drawing. Do you know how the drawings of huge structures, like buildings, bridges, and complex machines, are prepared? How a 20 feet building is represented by using 10 centimeters long lines on a building plan sheet. What is that mathematical parameter which allows you to convert dimensions so that they can properly fit in a drawing sheet? That mathematical parameter is nothing but scales. Well, let us see what a scale represents. We know that, we can represent every object in the real world, by drawing them on a piece of paper. For example, let us consider, a wrist watch. The internal structure of wrist watches, is made up of extremely small gears, of magnitude, about 1 mm. To represent them on paper, we need to enlarge them, according to their actual size. Can we represent large objects like a building, an aeroplane, with actual size? The answer is no, right? We can't represent large objects on paper, with their actual sizes. We need to reduce the actual size, to represent them on paper. So, while drawing objects on a paper, there is a need to reduce, or enlarge, the actual size. The proportion, by which the drawing of an object is reduced, or enlarged, is called the scale of drawing. The scale is defined as, the ratio of the linear dimensions of the object as represented in a drawing, to the actual dimensions of the same object. It is represented as, representative fraction, or representative factor, RF. Simply, it is the ratio of, the length of an object on drawing, to the actual length of the object. For example, if, we represent a 2 meters long wire, as a 2 centimeters long line, then the representative factor will be, the ratio of the length of the wire in drawing, to the actual length of the wire. Which further equals, 2 centimeters by 200 centimeters, which equals, 1 by 100. We have, three types of drawings. Full-sized drawings. Reduced-sized drawings. Enlarged-sized drawings. If, drawings are drawn with the same size, as the original objects, then they are called, full-sized drawings. For a full-sized drawing, the representative factor is, 1 is to 1. For example, RF equals 1 centimeter is to 1 centimeter. That means, a 1 cm original length is represented, as the same 1 cm in our drawing. If, drawings are drawn, with reduced size of the original objects, then they are called reduced size drawings. For a reduced size drawing, the RF is, 1 is to Y. Here, Y is greater than 1. For example, RF equals 1 cm is to 100 cm. That is, a 100 cm length is represented as 1 cm in our drawing. For example, bridges, buildings, ships. If, drawings are drawn, with enlarged size of the original objects, then they are called enlarged size drawings. For an enlarged size drawing, the RF is, X is to 1. Here, X is greater than 1. For example, RF equals 10 cm is to 1 cm. That is, a 1 cm length is represented as, 10 cm in our drawing. For example, screws, gears, small electronic gadgets. The common scales recommended while drawing are. In this video, we have introduced, the scales in engineering drawing. 